making corn holes. That's what we're doing this year. Yeah. There's a project every year. This year, corn holes. About got everything cut up for the corner hole. These are the pieces all cut up. Uh, we're going to be doing one more of those for the second set. Well, not the second set, but the other set of the corner hole. Uh, the, the ladies are doing the bean bags, so it's doing pretty sweet right now. Uh, this is the second one we're measuring right now and about to cut, so here's pretty much the second part of how to make a corn hole. Here we go. And now we're measuring up the boards and where we're going to put a hole. How are you doing that? Trying to find a perfect circle. That's, That's pretty cool. Whatever you're doing. That's how you make a perfect circle. That's how you make a perfect circle. Very good. What do you think about that, Corey? Pretty awesome. Oh, yeah. Quite awesome. It's extremely awesome. It's wicked awesome. Where'd you get the materials at? Eight. A friendly place. Yeah. So close and handy, isn't it? Oh yes. Oh. You did a good job. The corn hole. That's what the bags are going into. How big is that hole? You gotta make the hole exactly six inches. Six, six inches. inches? You did that on the same exact thing on the other one. All right. You got the hole for corn hole. Here you go. Good. There. There's the thing. Get everything hammered together. Boom. That's really like set. You know, you still have to put the you still have the legs on the bottom of this side. Yeah. Oh, there's the legs. Yep. Hmm? Actually, you should this off. Alright, as you can see, we put the frame together, we screwed them all in. Uh, our next step is putting the legs on. You get measure that out, put it in there, and we have to screw it in. It's the next step to making the rest of the cornhole. And once that's done, we'll have our first cornhole. Sweet! Not what do you think, Don? We're still waiting on the bags, aren't we? Yep. Mm -hmm. why, don't you, why don't you on that? What? Why don't you on that? Because I don't know how to sell. Oh, okay. There's the corn. There's the corn. Just get rid of the whole corn for the bean bags. But, yep, there you go. We're almost done. First product. I'll show you next. Alright, as you can see, we made the legs, and we made them so now that they can adjust. You can put them wherever you want. Fill a couple holes in them. Put there, put them through there like that. And boom. You can adjust them anytime you want. Anything with the other. So, instead of just having them straight up and down like they're going to do it officially, then you can adjust them however you want. So, any terrain you do it on, you can adjust it to how it's supposed to be. Sweet! I am. Um...
filling the bag with corn and I have to weigh it. And I'm using a bottle to fit into the hole and then pouring the corn inside so it won't make a mess. And it has to be anywhere between 14 and a half to 16 ounces. And the bag of cross is supposed to be at least like six inches across when this is all sewn. Yes. Back. So we cut it at seven inches across this way and seven inches across this way and then once you sew it and then you turn it inside out, it's going to equal about six inches across both ways. Right, and then we fill it and then we will take and we'll sew the, the hole up. We'll sew the hole up after we get all the corn in there. How's it coming, Kim? Good, I'm trying to get it all exact. Look, you you got all those bags done. You do a good job. Yeah. It's kind of fun doing it. Is it fun? Yeah. It's a good time. Yeah. I'm still sewing. I'm having fun and playing with this little uh, weight thing. <laughs> oh, look. What? Almost. You just need a couple more kernels of corn and it is exact. Okay, so you're sewing up the hole. Yeah, I got the hole here and it was kind of like fluffed out like that. You're just going to fold the inside in just like this and hold it while you have your needle and thread. And you're going to do the back stitch which mom showed you earlier. It's pretty easy. Just make sure that you get the folds in whenever you're sewing it. Good job. <laughs>